Welcome to my fictive bike check. My name is Scotty. We're in Bethlehem. Uh, we're gonna go over some things here. I guess we'll start off with the main, the frame. This is a S and M DTF. It is 21.5 top two. Uh, rear end is 13 and a half where I have it right now. Um, got some s and wide mouth pitch forks. Uh, frame forks and seat posts are all powder coated by Tim at Steadfast Powder Coating. Did a crazy job. It's so awesome. Um, it's not a name. There's no name for the color. It's just a number. Which is weird, but that's how powder coating works in some instances, I guess. Who the hell knows? But, hell yeah. Hit up Tim for anything you need. He has got it on lock. Um, s and Perfect 10 Bars. Trans Black. Uh, s and Credence Stem. Credence Grips. Uh, custom uh, Matt Behringer made bar ends. Uh, apparently, according to him, the only pair of four holes ever made that a good friend of mine had made for me for my 40th birthday, which is pretty sick. Um, so my wheels are profile. The front one is a mini with tie bolts. The rear is a left-hand drive Elite with nine-tooth tie driver, a tie axle, and RNC titanium axle nuts. Uh, 175 millimeter profile cranks with tie spindle. Uh, profile Imperial 27 tooth. 27.9 is the setup I prefer to run because it's not too hard, but it still gives you a little extra crankage. Uh, Odyssey Evo 2s, 2.5s, or whatever. Uh, cool stop brake pads. Uh, fly brake lever. I like it because it's super slim. Uh, Odyssey linear cable. Odyssey headset. Um, Odyssey Tom Dugan pedals. I like them because they're big and I got big feet. And, you know, that's how I roll. Uh, demolition seat. I believe it's Dennis Anderson, but I'm not positive on that. Um, rubber. Odyssey Aiken tires, front and back. Uh, 2.45 in the front and 2.25 in the back. Uh, I love this tire setup actually, it's sick um, and concrete and dirt, it's, I've never found a better combo and it just looks great having matching tires. Um, yeah, Odyssey headset I think, uh, tie spindle, tie bolts in my cranks, Tubalito in my front wheel, I added Tubalito in the back but I don't know. They're not worth the money, but you didn't hear that from me. Um, just running a, a claw lightweight tube in the back. Uh, seems a little more case friendly. <laughs> uh, that's about it. I got some custom doodads. I got uh, this little devil uh, tire cap I've had for about 15 years. That's original. Most of the chrome and black paint that was originally on it is off of it. Now it's just like a weird yellow color, but can't get rid of that. Uh, I got a custom leather Posh Woods cable wrap that our buddy Brian had made for everybody at the trails. You can give him a follow at Frosty610. He's a solid dude. He does a lot of stuff for the trails. And that's cool. Um, yeah, that's about it. She's uh, she's clean and sturdy. Simple. Um, you know, give a shout out to S&M. Huge supporters of the woods here. Vicati and Posh. 
always support them, supported them forever. They support us. It's a great thing. Um, Odyssey, Empire, BMX, um, everybody else that helps out with the woods. It's awesome to keep our scene alive. Um, Caddy and Posh would not be around now if it wasn't for companies stepping up like that. So it's pretty sick. Uh, shout out to Fictive for everything they do. They're awesome. Um, cop some patches. You can make some custom clothes, like one of a kind shit. Or you can just get a beanie, you know. Or some shirts. Whatever. Hit them up. All right. Uh, I'm out. Have a good one.